I ordinarily don't do tributes to musicians when they pass away only because I usually don't feel the need to do that because each musician has their own individual thing that I could relate to, but in life, I understand that people live and people die, and I'm usually thinking that other fans can say more than I could. But in this case, I felt like it's only right to talk about how I felt about Eddie Van Halen because he was totally unique and it really stunned me when I found out suddenly about his passing. I, I thought it wasn't real. I saw that it was from Google News, so I knew it was not fake, but I wanted to wait a little bit before I said anything because I wanted to hear what other people had to say. And so I'll tell you this, I, um, I mean, I can understand his passing because of what he went through and there were rumors or statements here and there about whether he was doing well or whether he wasn't doing well. But the thing that makes it more sad is that I feel like there was a possibility that if he had gotten healthier and better, that he maybe would have come out with more music or a tour or something with some of the original members of the group. Or possibly the original members of Van Halen. And I feel like I would have wanted to know a little more about his condition because it would have prepared me a little bit more. But I understand that he was a private person and didn't want a lot of information put out about him. The one thing that I will say is that he did do a lot of music that was unreleased. And one consolation can be that perhaps some unreleased music could be put out by him so then that way the fans can feel the joy of hearing the stuff that he did because he loved doing music. He wasn't always into putting stuff out on the spur of the moment. He figured that if he wanted to put something out, he would, and if he didn't want to, he wouldn't, but he was fine making music. And so that's one thing that I'm curious about as to whether or not some of that older music would come out. I had heard about an interview that he did where he mentioned there were about 50 or 60 songs that he and David Lee Roth had worked on when they were trying to do a reunion or some sort of studio work during the time that the greatest hits thing came out 
and Eddie was saying he didn't know whether or not it would ever be released. So he had tons of songs that were in tapes on his studio wall that I would say would equal to maybe more music than I ever did. And so these are thoughts that I'm thinking because I don't have anything prepared to say, but the one thing that I feel bad about a lot is how the fans are affected by it. Because me, I understand it. I, I know how life process works. People live and people pass. And so for me, I can deal with it because I understand that that's a part of the natural process of life. But I do know people who have talked about how they felt and I've read or heard things that other people have said and that's what makes me feel like I wish I could console them and say something that can help them go through it because they are hurting by this and so is our music culture because we won't get anyone who had his sound and it was a very powerful thing he wasn't only a guitarist he was an innovator in a way that I haven't heard anyone else be innovative so I would like to say that I hope that the fans who are going through pain right now for this, I wish them healing because they um, are very creative people too and they were influenced and touched by what he did. And I, I, I am not only thinking of how I'm personally feeling, I'm thinking of how we as a community of fans who loved his music are feeling. So I'm not only sad about his passing, I'm also sad about the sadness of the fans. And so I, I just would like to say that I wish everyone love and healing who are going through stuff like this because this was a pretty big blow even for me and I usually don't do tributes to musicians only because I tend to want to just deal with it on my own and not say anything unless I'm talking to someone in person or making a small post somewhere but in this case I felt like I needed to say something he was way too important in my life and Van Halen was too important and influence on a lot of the art and music that I did growing up so um, yeah, I'm not, I'm not happy about it at all. I'm, I'm rather bummed, but I'm also hoping that everyone can, um, get through this and, um, um feel better, um, if not feeling better about this, at least have your, your day be less sad 
for whatever other reasons. If you've got happy things coming up or you're able to process this better. Either way, I, I just hope that everyone gets through this and I wish you all love and peace and um, rest in peace, Eddie, you, you were great.